and Kazuma. Uh, yes, but I'm on my audio script. Can cut into that one-up lead, get all square here. This putt will break to his right. Good spot to putt from. Would like it to be a little shorter, but there you can see the par and the win. Now we're back all square. Well done. Confident putt there. The Western Golf Association, the BMW Championship part of the playoffs, is going there next year. Western Golf Association is responsible for so many important championships over centuries here. Putt right Huge here. Huge putt right here. Explain why. Uh, well, he's just lost basically two holes he should have won. Should have been two up in this match easily. Then now he can get back in control, running out of time. There you go. That's why he's medalist right there. But, yeah, the international, I, I used to love that event. And you know why I loved it? The milkshakes. Ball goes so far in Colorado. The, it made me feel shakes. like I was a strong man. It was the milkshakes. Yeah. And as you said, it could come down to a one-hole match. Makes this putt here or Valdez misses. This is to win the hole, draw back to even, tied. I'm still an all-square guy, I got to tell you. Yeah. I agree. I like all-square. <laughs> tied seems a little bit like a soccer match. There you go. And this putt here, um, Baca's also putting up the slope. The ball, the cup is sitting on a bit of a ridge, so it kind of goes up the hill on either side of the cup. Breaking to his right, he can be aggressive. Oh, he is. Oh, oh he is. There you go. I mean, uh, clearly carrying the momentum now, all even. North Shore Country Club, the venue this, to tie the hole and stay tied with four holes remaining. Yeah, this putt's got more break than the clear's putt, so. Got to match line and speed. And again, what, what do we talk about? The putt to, to have the hole, a topper. And he does it. Very nice. Well, I guess McClear is not away, but Gabori can put him away, and he does. One down. How about that, though? His first lead of the match happens at the 15th hole, three holes remaining. Yeah, good time to get the lead. I'm still working on the Scotty Cameron with the flange in the back that anyone can pick it up. <laughs> I'm about 60% of mine. All right. This is a wonderful spot to be in. Two putts to win, coming right up the hill. Right up the hill, not a problem here. Yeah, I imagine he's pretty relaxed and he doesn't have that far from the hole, but just outside of 10 feet. So just cruising on up there. Number 45 in the world amateur golf rankings will defeat number 15 in the world golf amateur rankings. Doesn't need that second putt. Gustav Fremont on to the quarters. Match is far from over. You know, the first time I met Preston was at a college event, the Southwestern Intercollegiate, and he called me ma'am. And then a couple years later, we were partners at the Arnold Palmer Cup. So we were peers, not ma'am. <laughs> yes, yes ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Exactly. <laughs> for the same thing. Some raise. Yes. Stays in it, still in a position where he's one down with two holes left, a whole lot better. Now McLean. And just 152, he ended up hitting driver McLean, but just a couple of yards ahead of Preston, who hit a three wood. And this is right at it, another great iron shot. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. it bounced around the hole. This Almost won the match. Over. Yeah, <laughs> With that almost shot. a walk off right there. Through 10 holes now. Summer Hayes is one down, two holes remaining. He's got a long birdie putt. And McLean almost hold it. A moment ago, Kabori, second hole, his 20th of the day in this match. Third shot. Oh, my. He could win this match. Tremendous shot there. I, I have never seen more wild swings in, in these matches late. 
and head scratching misses. Yes. There you go. Grab the momentum late and never let go. Well, with eight holes remaining, he was only three down, and then he ended up scratching his way back and finally moves on.